Hi everybody, how are you doing? How do you study English? Is it good? Or are you looking for how to speak English well? Actually, I was one of them. I was been looking for how to speak English well over 25 years. But finally I found out uh, how to do it. That's why I can speak English like this. Uh, it is shadowing. Shadowing made me improve your, my hearing ability, ability and also practiced, practiced uh, how to speak English well. So that's why I, really would, I would really recommend you to do shadowing if you, if you like to speak English well. So why don't you try to do that? But before you try to do uh, shadowing, there is only one condition. You have to change your breathing in order to make a sound of consonant. Otherwise, uh, it's very hard for you uh, to catch up what they say. Then, shadowing, uh, if you keep practice shadowing, it uh, makes you uh, an English brain. So, why don't you try to do that? So, I'll show you how to do it. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So, so, what's so, what's so funny thing? thing? I, I, um, uh, uh it's something. Well, we well, keep it down, down there. out there. Took practice. practice. If you bubble will go to the movie with you, you gotta, you gotta like stop, stop thinking the dog with the text my the budget real Yeah, you can show, you can show one, show one. it doesn't matter to go to the movie with you. you. And these things with the love of one and the fun excitement. She needs to feel the broke of it, man. She needs to be concerned about the wolves. Oh. oh man, make a good thing. You have hear there are the wolves in my room. Really? I know, I put it pretty exciting, right? I guess she doesn't like me. Come on, fan, I don't feel like a bunny. You be the bubble with in a week. Anyway, I'm for one. Think of you are great. Hi, eh, kono yori desu ne. Ego wo kite, eh, sono mamma. あの、真似てね、話すんですけど、まあ、真似てっていうよりは、えっ、ー、と、ちゃんとしたアルファベットで追っかけていくって感じですね。で、ちゃんとしたアルファベットって何っていうんですけども、あのー、えー、ちゃんとしたアルファベットで追っかけていくんですけども、まあ、ちゃんとしたアルファベットって何っていうと、あのー、皆さん、ABCDEFG はね、やっぱり言えるんですけども、えっ、ー、と、その英語のシーン、シーン、母音とか、シーン、母音、えー、シーン母音シーンとかこう一つのそのえっとシーン単音の音と、えー、母音が一つついたとかシーン単音シーン二つの音が一つにくっついたとか、えー、そういうのになってるとやっぱり難しいんですねですので、えー、まずシーンの音がはっきり話せないとこれうまく話せませんでシーンの音はなぜはっきり話せないかって言ったら日本人はもうシーンの音単音で話す音で慣れてないですシーンの音単音ってどんな音なのっていうところなんですけども母音を抜いた音なんですけど、えっと、英語のシーンの音ってこう息が僕が「はー」って出す「あはー」ってしますよねでその「はー」ってしたところを下唇とか下ベロとか下唇とか口の中でどうも作ったりとか、えっと、出る音を邪魔する時に出る音がシーンの音なんですよね。ですので邪魔されるとはっきりした音にならない。ですのであの英語のアルファベット ABCD は単音で言えるけどあの単語になると音がちゃんとその音にならないです。でそういった方たちの特徴としてはあの鳩胸だったり猫背だったりあとローマ字読みで英語の発音を練習してる人話してる人ですね、えー、っとそういう方たちは肺にたくさん空気が入らないんで、まあ、あの勢いのある、えー、っとその音が出せないんですよ。でそういう方たちは整体に行って肋骨の筋肉横隔膜の筋肉を緩めてもらってあと腹横筋っていうお腹の筋中の筋肉を緩めてもらうと、えー、この振動音がはっきり出せるような、えー、と息の使い方ができるようになりますでその後ね口の中でその R の発音とか R の発音それから Thank you の TH の発音とかねいろいろそういうのを自分で練習してきてシャドーイングしてくださいでシャドーイングも 0.5 から 8% スピード早いですから始めて 0.751 で1のスピードで何が手に入れられるのかって言ったらまずスピードが手に入れられますね慣れでスピード慣れですねそしてえっとリズムを取ってくるんでイントネーションというのが分かりますでそれで最後はその自分が今
、えー、っと聞いてる、ね、音,の音源の英語の文章を、えー、まあえっと、僕はアニメだったら、えっと、そこのセリフなんですけどそれを見てそして日本語でそれを、えー、調べて理解するでそのことができてくると脳の中に英語を理解する、えー、一部ができてきてそれをたくさんやってくると、えー、英語がねスラスラ喋れるようになってくると思いますねどなたも今言った手順を間違えなくてチャドウィングやっていただければ英語がちゃんと話せるようになると思っていますので頑張ってみてくださいねそれでは How's that spider coming along, Teddy? It's coming along wonderfully, Glenn. Thank you very much. How's your so-called bat? My bat is spectacular. Thanks for asking. Nice ladder, by the way. Thank you. I can't tell if you're being sarcastic. Oh, I was. And now I realize that we have the same so maybe now I'm being sincere. So we both agree these are great ladders. Is this the right tone of voice to be saying that, idiot, on a nice ladder? Oh, yeah, this is a great tone of voice. Yeah, you shut up! Besides, I can't hear you over all the work I'm doing over here. I'm doing more work! Work, 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 work. work good, smell better, that's what I say. Can I open my eyes yet? I want to see my babies in the costumes. We've been ready for five minutes. We're waiting for you! Oh, look at you! Who are you dressed as? I'm Andre 3000 the Giant. Oh, so fresh and so Jane. Who are you, Louise? I'm a dragon with a girl tattoo. Ooh, you flipped the script! What do you mean? And what are you, Tina? I'm none of your business. Okay, jeez, touchy. No, oh, Lynn, that's her costume. Do you seriously not get it? No, I got it. I got, I got it. What, what is it, then? She's a nun. She's a cranky nun. What about the briefcase? Why? Well, that's why she's cranky. She's got a lot of work to do. Hey, Teddy. Cool costume? Yeah, I thought if I was going to be working out here on Halloween night, I should probably blend in. I didn't want to look weird, Bob. Uh-huh. How are you doing on the decorations? Great. I'm almost done. Just because it's definitely not before Halloween anymore, it is Halloween. You know, kids are trick-or-treating all over the place right now. But look at that spider and that web. Ooh, scary. Isn't the spider scary, kids? Sure is. That spider makes me think, whoa, no way. Yeah, took a lot of work, but hey, when you nail it, you nail it. Ah, holy crap, his flies, he's flying all over the place. That's amazing. It looks so real. That's better than real. Ah. That's better than bats. Yours doesn't move? No, it doesn't move at all. God, it's like something out of Da Vinci's sketchbook. Uh, I know a guy. I, I, I can go get a motor, a servo. This spider's gonna be crawling all over the place. I'll be right back. Yep. Happy Halloween! Bats Entertainment, am I right? Oh, uh, Glenn! Oh, he does smell good. All the way from here. Ooh, I got some sticky sugar booms. Nice. Me too! They're gonna be the second best booms I dropped today! Kaplunk! I can't open my mouth or over. It's so good. Yep, I can feel the flavor seeping into my teeth. Zeke? That's loud. Hey, Tina. So you're trick-or-treating, huh? We're not. You can say we're more into the trick part this year. Ha! Yeah! <laughs> That's loud! Yeah. Mischief. <laughs>
Well, that one didn't explode, but you get the point. So much mischief. We're gonna go to Mutilation Mansion at Wonder Wharf later. I heard they jump out and grab you. They really shake you. Hi, hi. Come on, like Ow. this. Come Jeez. on, shake. Ow. And they look all mutilated. Tina, you should go. It's fun. Hmm, I don't think so. Mutilation Mansions kind of freak me out. Duh, that's the point. Yeah, Tina, you don't go to Mutilation Mansion to relax and unwind. <laughs> it's not a spa. <laughs> you guys are idiots. I'm getting candy. <sighs> Are you student 100.000? Uh, yeah? I'm student 99.999. Nice to meet you. I think we're gonna be great friends, don't you? I... I always thought you were a mere statistical abstraction. Nope, I'm just a regular kid like you. Only smarter. Hey, hey, recess is a-wasting. What do you guys say we go play on the jungle gym? Uh, yeah, last one to old Rusty is a rotten egg soaked in hot sauce that someone spit on. Come on, Gretchen. Come on, Gus. Okay, I'd hate to be some sort of yucky egg. Yeah, what have I got to lose? Come on, Jerry, do you too? No, I don't really believe in competition. Competition? It's just a race to the jungle gym. It's all in the spirit of fun. Okay. Whoa! Oh, side egg. Me too. You beat me. Yeah, well, you know, on the spirit of fun. I, I can't believe it. What kind of shoes you got on? Same as yours. So it's not the shoes. Well, I think I just had a little adrenaline going, being new and all. How are you at basketball? Um, okay. A little help? Want to play? Maybe later. Sure. Man, that guy is good. Don't rub it in. Perhaps Jug Jared would enjoy the challenge. Oh, no, I couldn't. Sure you could, buddy. Don't be afraid. Smelly won't hurt you. Well, I have always wanted to try this. Sucker. Ah, big old slab of fresh meat. Somebody say one, two, three, go. One, one two, two, three, three go. go. Want to call it a tie? Ties on for Father's Day. I'm Wednesday. You sure? I won't settle for less. Okay, I'm Wednesday. You slammed me. True, but you did very well, considering your size. Well, better get to class. But, but, nobody's ever slammed me before. Nobody. Look at him, sitting there, eating his perfect little lunch out of his perfect little senior fusion lunchbox. Makes me sick. Yeah, Mr. 38 Schools. Mr. Faster Than Everybody. Mr. Perfect. Is quality a crime? What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying, excellence is something to be treasured, not scorned. We should be proud to be in the presence of someone of Jared's superior abilities. Yeah, well, just you wait till his superior abilities shine on you, pal. I'll welcome it with open arms. If love is beauty and love is blind, then it's out of sight and out of mind. Then how can you be with me still, like hummingbird and daffodil? Morning dew may dampen grass, but not our love that's here to last. Bravo! What a beautiful soul. I hate that guy. How could this have happened? How? I'm the best poet in fourth grade, not Jared. Fair as foul and foul as... Oh, I can't remember the rest of it. Oh, come on, Mikey. You're overreacting. Am I? Look around, TJ. Look around. The diggers can't dig because Jared's already dug the perfect hole. The swinger can't swing because Jared's already swung over the top of the swing set. Eight times. And look what he's done to Tubby. Him used to be best burper in kindergarten. Then big kid Jared and a giant burp shake windows. Now Tubby say him never burp again. Face it, TJ, recess is a disaster. Oh, uh, you guys are letting this Jared thing get to you. Look at me, I'm not upset. Hey, Tej, you know the clackers Miss Finster confiscated from us last spring? The ones you said there was no plan good enough to get back? Yeah. Well, Jared just got him back. Woohoo! Jared's a menace, and he must be stopped. I say we tie him up and dress him in last year's ultra suede. Let's see him try to accessorize that. I say we tell Finster he's a communist. Perhaps 
we should all join hands and visualize him gone. I say we pummel the show off. Where is he? He's inside lecturing the faculty about his latest theories on education. No, no, Miss Goki. You've got Vygotsky confused with Dewey. You've got a scaffold, kids. Mentor their behavior. Thank you, Jared. What was cloudy is now clear. Fraternizing with the enemy? Add treason to his list of offenses. That makes noise! <laughs> There's one thing we could do. It's brutal, but it just might do the trick. What's that, JJ? Instigate a lockout. <gasps> a lockout? We haven't done one of those since we locked up that boogering kid back in first grade. Hey, I got over it. So will he. Guys, it's the only way. Hey, guys, what you digging? Can I help? Okay, I guess I'll just do a little swinging then. Hi, Springer girl. Mind if I join you? Sure, we don't have to talk. We'll just swing. Taken. 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 <sighs> hey, guys. How about three-way? Only got two bits. Want to play pickle? Want to play leave us alone? Okay, I'll bite. What's going on around here? Think about it, Jerry. You chose to come in here and feed us all and everything? Well, guess what? We choose to put a stop to it. It's a lockout, pal. Get used to it. Huh. You know, I'm actually sort of impressed. You guys really came up with a good one. A good one? What's that supposed to mean, perfect boy? It's just, this happens at every school that I go to. Eventually, the kids realize that I'm good at stuff and shun me. Oh, they all have their own way of doing it. TPing my bike, dumping my books, training a hamster to use my desk as a toilet. But a school-wide lockout? That's a good one. But before I spend recess in the library for the rest of the year, let me just say one thing. All I wanted was to be friends with you guys. I never wanted to show anybody up. I didn't tell Miss Grokey I knew the right answer to Gretchen's problem, or challenge Vince to a foot race, or Spinelli to arm wrestling. You guys challenged me. I mean, what do you want me to do, pretend I'm no good? Works for me. Yeah. Well, I can't do that. Don't you see? I can't stop being good at stuff any more than Gretchen can stop being smart, or Vince can stop being fast, or Mikey can stop being a sweet soul giant. Gee, most people don't get that about me right away. I'd trade places with any of you guys any day. You think it's easy? Easy being Mr. Perfect? You think it's easy getting locked out? Or facing down angry mobs? Or opening your thermos to find a full of paper mache mix? Paper mache mix? That's hilarious! We should have thought of that one! <laughs> Shh! You know how people say, no matter how good you get, there's always someone out there who's better than you? Well, for me, it's different. There might not be anybody better, but there's always somebody happier. Well, anyway, that's about it. I just wanted to say that before I was locked out forever. What's the... Kevin wants to say something to Perfect Man. What's that? Kid, you got chops. Yeah! Finally, it is my passion for military miniatures, the love of a snake named Herbert, and much, much more that make me someone extra special. The end. My goodness, Gus, that's the longest paper you've ever written. Well, I got some pointers from a pal. We're looking for Jared Smith. Over here, gentlemen. Uh, Jared, there's been a situation. The president needs your advice. Again? Sorry. Adults, why can't they learn to solve their own problems? But Jared, you can't go now. Since I've been playing against you, I got better game. And feel this muscle I got building on this arm. Go on, feel it. Sorry, guys. Duty calls. Jared, you will not forget me. Oh, he executed the perfect bit.